Good evening one and all. It has been a hot minute since I got a video out. Multiple reasons, just work life um, and getting sick and a cough and losing my voice and all of those things. Um, so if you haven't joined me before, my name is Alicia. Um, our channel is Our Golden Acre. Uh, we live on one acre and um, my husband and I both work full time. We have a very energy German Shepherd. Nala, come here. Nala here. Nala here. Come here. <laughs> um, I swear she takes about one step and moves 12 feet. Um, and we love to garden and grow our own food. We've got a few chickens. We've got maple trees on our property where we harvest the sap. And we're kind of getting ready to get into the 2023 season. Uh, our seeds are ordered. Um, we're going to be starting onion seeds and some brassicas here in a few weeks. Um, look at this guy. <clears throat> so, and our maple season usually starts about mid-February. Um, we'll tap our trees when we start getting to freezing weather's uh, freezing weather at night and above freezing during the day um, so we've got a lot of projects coming on um, we've got a small kind of pavilion chicken or it's called like a grill shed it's just a open um, structure with a roof on it um, I want to try harvesting rainwater for the garden from that this year um, over that a-frame there um, we had the chickens in for a while to um, kind of scratch the, that area at the end of our raspberry bed. We're hoping the raspberries kind of naturally move into that since the soil's disturbed. We'll see how that works. Um, so we've got a lot of things going on. Um, we'd love for you to join us for this season. This is our second season gardening um, uh, with you on YouTube. Uh, thank you for those that have joined us before. And thank you for those that are about to join us for the 2023 season. Um, this is our garden space. Here, let's get a little closer. You stay over here, ma'am. Um, so this is our garden space um, over here. This bed right here, with all these leaves, this is going to be new garden space. Ma'am, stay over here. Nala. Nala here. Nala here. Good girl. We're just a puppy. We're only a year old. <clears throat> um, so <coughs> this is a <coughs> new garden space. Um, we've run our chickens on this a few times um, during the summer to add some manure and kind of disturb the soil. We've added multiple. Um, we collect our grass clippings and have covered it in grass clippings um, over last summer. And then we covered it in leaves this fall. So we're trying a, a no-till, completely no-till, just covering the soil and seeing how that works. Um, this is the regular garden. And let's go see the chickens and see how they're doing. All right, so here's the main part of the garden. Um, this has been several years and multiple years in adding. Um, our winter came on really fast and really hard this year. Like there were things that normally will produce for us for a while into the early winter, late fall, early winter, and it all, we lost it all this year because um, we'd been able to like go uncovered with arugula and some things um, before, like for a while this year, we just couldn't. Um, here's our pretty simple chicken system. Um, now during the summer, our chickens are in a mobile coop that we move throughout the whole backyard. Um, now they're in this um, kind of high tunnel that works really, really well. Um, we have them on deep bedding. Um, so all their manure throughout the winter, um, late fall, early winter, early spring, um, gets mixed into um, all of these leaves. Nala really wants to have. Over there you see we dump um, our compost. So our food waste gets dumped there. So the chickens either eat it or mix it in with leaves. <clears throat> and then this is their nice dry space um, that works fantastic. 
during the cold and wet season so it gives them plenty of space in here that's dry and leaves to pick through and that kind of thing so this worked well over um, around Christmas we had that storm that was so windy and so cold and this gave them a nice covered dry space to be because um, the main thing chickens need is they need the wind off of them so we've got lots more to come um, I have started so many videos that just haven't been able to finish so we're going to keep this one simple and get it posted a um, couple weeks we're going to be starting onions uh, a few weeks after that we're going to be tapping our maple trees and the season is so close to beginning I can't wait to get my hands in the soil and be outside and get some of these things done again my name is Alicia welcome to our golden acre thank you so much for having joined us or choosing to join us in this next season uh, hope you're having a good day wherever you are